Look, look how big that one is. Dude. Oh wow. But again, we're eating chicken wings, not drumsticks or thighs. Look at this. That's big bertha right there. Fresh in, no, uh, no wings were harmed by <laughs> steroidal pumps. And today we are shooting a good old fashioned cockfight between the American powerhouses of KFC Popeyes and a family owned restaurant local to San Diego. So we're about to get knees deep in some fried chicken goodness. What do you think, Glenn? Oh man, this is a case of David versus Goliath. Mm -hmm. You see if the little guy can take down the big giant. So we're about to get into this video and it starts right there. What's up guys? Welcome back to our channel. Hey, if this is your first time, be sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can be a part of our family. We're about to get into some chicken, so let's get right into it. Hey, what's going on guys? We are here in this battle of the chicken or a good old fashioned cockfight. <laughs> and for our very first stop, we are at a local uh, establishment here, a uh, private owner, uh, actually one of my college buddies. So. Uh, it is here local to San Diego. Um, they have two locations called Cross Street Chicken and Beer. It is a Korean style restaurant and um, their focus is on, is on chicken. So we've hit up their OG chicken, fried chicken plate right here. Um, and they are chicken wings, but they are not skimpy at all. So we're about to dive in um, on their original flavor and a soy and what was it? Soy garlic. Soy garlic. So we also got uh, tots. This is their uh, top dish, and it also has, of course, their famous style chicken. Yes. Very yummy. Well, I don't know. I haven't had it yet, but it looks delicious. So and this then, is Glenn's first time here. Uh, I've only been here once, but it's been a couple years. So they are. I've recently seen on social media that they have been voted one of the best fried chickens in America. So uh, don't forget about out. the corn. Hey. Get that cone out of my face. So uh, we're about to dive in. I don't know if you can see it. Is it still hot? Okay, look. So this is corn. They're corn cheese. Cheese corn, whatever. Cheese corn. Served maybe. on a skillet. So when it first came out, it was piping hot. It was sizzling. It was sizzling, like, dude. It's like seasick, man. It was so good. And again, uh, the chicken that we have on deck is their original, um, original recipe. Uh, you have the choice of going uh, regular or spicy. We went with regular. Uh, we just wanted to get that, you know, their, their popular uh, chicken just to taste it out. And I think we're about to dive in. About to dive in right now, baby. Uh, and mind you, the other two that are in the ring with us today in this video are literally across the street. Can you see? And Popeye. So we've got a few days ahead of us. We can see it from where we're sitting right now. So uh, we're about to dive in, guys. Here we go. All right, so I won't get one of these guys. So look, yeah, their, their um, original, their OG chicken has some kind of seasoning. Looks like a dry rub. Okay, I'll try the. I'll go with the, the original first. Cheers, man. Cheers. Oh no! Mind you, this is my first meal of the day. Four o'clock. Oh. Mmm. These are very plump. For a oh, week. Look at that. Look at that. So wow. they got the driver Yeah. Oh. They have a unique batter. It's yeah. very, very different. It's not like straight crispy. It's no. Like crispy on the outside, no. but then like kind of fluffy on the inside. It's fluffy, man. That's exactly the word I was looking for. Fluffy. It's really good. It's delish, man. Oh. Usually with wings too, at least for me, 
I need something to dip it in. Yeah. Like I need ranch and blue cheese. Uh -huh. This one is really good. See the dry rub that they have on there. Not spicy whatsoever. Hey guys, if you're if you're from San Diego and you've been here before, leave us a comment. Let us know what you think about this place. Yeah, this place is only two years old. Uh, we're celebrating our two years. Um, this place is located in the Asian hub of eateries in San Diego. Oh, yeah. Uh, Convoy Street. So if you are familiar with the area, Convoy has just a strip of restaurants. And uh, Glenn mentioned earlier today, we could basically shoot 50 videos on this location, on this trip alone, just because of all the eateries that, yeah. that they have on site. So, if yeah. you're ever in the area, check it out. Yeah, check it out. So you can get Vietnamese, Chinese, Japanese, Korean, Mongolian, you name it. Would you consider this like Chinatown? No, or is this it's like Asia. Like Asian like, town maybe? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thailand. Don't even, even go to Bangkok though. <laughs> So my next chicken is the soy garlic chicken. Oh, it is glistening and it looks delicious. So it has a different texture. It look, looks like it's gonna be a little bit sweet. Mmm. Oh, holy cow. Money? Yeah, bro. You grab me one of those bad boys. Yeah. Ooh, it smells really good. Look at that, really tasty. Tommy, congrats, brother. You have done an amazing job. So you guys don't know who Tommy is. Tommy is uh, Alan's friend who owns this, owns this place. So the other location, the other location is in Encinitas. About 20 minutes from here? Yeah. San Diego um, and again this place is not mm. only chicken but beer they have mm -hmm. a good beer list too so I'm having a triple IPA from knee deep <laughs> knee deep wow this soy and garlic is I'm telling you you don't so need good. you don't need any sauces like this is it and the chicken is plump mm. yeah Wow. All right, so soy, original. Obviously original, it's gonna be original, not oh, regular. Man. Nothing too crazy about it, it's still very good. But the soy garlic is so much flavor. It has a slight sweetness to it. Dude. I like the fluffy batter. Yeah. It's like crispy slash fluffy. Mm-hmm. So I'm gonna dig into this uh, corn. Yeah. Or chard. Corn, what? Okay, that's it. <laughs> that's it. I culminated right now. Dude, that very smoky corn. It's so good. Check out this corn. Look at that corn out of my face. <laughs> Look at that char. That's the char you're talking about right Tell there, me, dude, man. Once you bite into it, dude. Oh, oh, oh. dude, it smells uh, mm. very smoky. Oh, oh it's smoky. So there, good. there it is. Hey, you are on point with the words today. I'm telling you, man, you're a wordsmith. So we gotta pace ourselves because <laughs> yeah. we're hitting up opponent number two and three next. But I can already tell that this place is giving that uh, those two giants a run for their money for sure. Pika soju. Yeah. So this, what I was drinking earlier, uh, our this this drink here is called pico pika soju. Soju with. Uh, Mango and lemonade, and, uh, crusted on the top with <laughs> dusted tahini. That is not Dorito dust, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> so, so soju. Mm, if you tajin. don't know what that is, damn. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Glenn was having a little too much on that rim. He puts uh, a new definition on a rim job. <laughs> rim, rim, rim. Right? You know, I could lick rims full time. Huh? Again, we. All right, so this is some good stuff here from Cross Street Chicken and Beer here in San Diego. Uh, very filling, very big portions of the chicken. They're, and again, they're wings, so they're typically wings are very small, but these are plump, juicy, super flavorful. So, you know, we got to save some room in our bellies for, uh, yeah. you know, about uh, for round two and three, which is at KFC and Popeyes, which is literally across the way here. Yeah. So uh, tune in, guys, as we will 
head over there in just a few minutes. So, peace out. Hey, what's going on guys? Uh, we are at stop two um, on this good old fashioned cockfight between <laughs> the American powerhouses of KFC, Popeyes, and Cross Street Chicken and Beer. And uh, we are full from Cross Street. They had amazing food, so we're at KFC this yeah. time around. Um, as you can see, our, our portion size has uh, dramatically decreased. <laughs> yeah. uh, we went with their wings as well, their Nashville wings. So that looks pretty good. Um, I don't know. Our tummies are full though, right? They're full. Man? Yeah, but we're gonna, I don't know, we're gonna decide. Well, this is our second spot, but this is, dude, I can't even, I'm so sleepy right now. <laughs> uh, so this is, uh, yeah, man, um, our second spot, and we'll see how it compares to the first spot. And uh, KFC, guys, you guys know it, extra crispy, original. Um, and then now they got this Nashville flavor, so. Yeah. Um, no sauces, just straight chicken. Straight so chicken, man. Are, Cheers, these man. are these boneless? No. Um, Bone in? Can't tell. We'll see. Hot. Piping hot. <laughs> like temp <laughs> temperature hot. You know what? Also flavor hot. Yeah. It's oily. Very, very oily. Yeah, that's <clears throat> that's definitely mm. American. No, yeah. that's definitely American food right here. Oh yeah, oily man, super oily. I mean, it is fried, but yeah. You got grease. Look at that sauce there. Look at that. I'm gonna dip it. Let's see, oh, my stomach's gonna kill oh. me for this. Oh, fire off. <laughs> It's going all over the place, man. <laughs> mm. It's not bad. Yeah. It's just hot, like temperature wise. So the Nashville flavor has a kind of a kick. Wow. Ah. It's a little spicy. So we went from a full table of food at Cross Street. To this one little bowl. Yeah. yeah. It's good stuff, but crispy, yeah. spicy. It's flavorful. But I think the one thing that I'm not a fan of is the greasiness. Yeah. Extremely greasy, man. You get what you pay for. <laughs> yeah. But you know, they say that uh, you know the fat makes everything taste better, so. Yeah. It's not bad. It's, it's not bad. It's actually good. I think it's, I think we're at a disadvantage because we're extremely full from our very first one. That is true. So, that is true. But for the sake of the video, we wanted to get you guys in on our take on KFC's fried chicken. Now, our final stop, already dreading it, is Popeyes. Even though Popeyes is good, I've never had Popeyes wings. I've had their chicken sandwich, and then obviously their, their standard chicken, fried chicken, so I'm um, curious to see how that goes. So you guys stay tuned, we'll, we'll yeah. be hitting that spot up next, and um, hopefully it'll be good, hopefully our stomachs can handle it. But again, it'll be round three round of this three, bout, man. of this job for job bout. Job so, for job. Uh, stay tuned guys, we appreciate y'all. Turns out this place isn't even open, so uh, <laughs> we walked right up and look at construction everywhere. Like, as a matter of fact, there's trucks. They got like tractors and all that good stuff. And yeah, so turns out we won't be doing a review at Popeyes. So uh, whatever though, because I'm full. I'm stuffed, man. I am stuffed. So just to wrap up, it is the uh, good old fashioned cockfight here in San Diego between Cross Street Chicken and Beer and I guess just KFC. KFC. Uh, we already had our minds made up from the jump and yeah. it has to. we have to give a big thumbs up to Cross Street Chicken and Beer. Awesome food, plump ass chicken, 
Um, very tasty and uh, their appetizers are amazing. So that's it guys. Speaking of thumbs up, man, give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. So don't forget. Yeah, and as always, until next time, we love you guys. Only going peace. peace. We miss you, Rambo. Ooh.